Okay guys, uh, I'm the Grumpy Blogger, and this is a continuation of the one I just did. Well, it's not a continuation, it's another day's episode. But uh, as I said earlier, I had to go and come up the other direction than, than what I turned on the yesterday's video. I hope it was yesterday's video, either that or I decided not to use it, but I'm at the smoke shop and I don't have my second camera set up. I just got my phone here and using it for what it's worth. And, uh, but I had to, the reason I had to, because I've got to go to the grocery store and pick up some things that I don't want to, uh, I don't want to pick that, you know, pick up groceries and stuff and then have to come up here and go down there and do all that. You know, it's just like, I'm just going to pick up the cigarettes first and then go down that direction because that's the way I'll be heading, you know. So, uh, anyways, you know, Walmart seems to be on this this new kick of you know reactionary market bull you know uh, because of the shootings they're not selling handgun they quit selling handguns several years ago and then after that they started selling you know they they, they quit now they're going to quit you know they quit selling certain types of rifles because they look like an, an AK so. Or an AR-15. I need a carton of Marlboro 100 lights. Marlboro 100 lights? Yeah, carton. Anyways, uh, so now, because there's been some deaths related to vaping, and I know a lot of the guys out there vape, uh, well, hang on a second, yeah, okay. She worked a pretty one. Matter of fact, she had so much perfume on about made my eyes water. You know, I had the 75 in the night. I had that and I didn't have to break a 20. Instead, I had screwed up. So let me get the window up here. Because... All right, now I'm off to the grocery store and then I'm going down to pick up uh, dinner. But anyways, what I was talking about, and yeah, I'm going to see Nor Lopez, which I said the day before's video. Uh, Walmart's been jumping on the bandwagon every time a tragedy happens or every time something comes up and they think they're going to get regulated or they think this or they think that. They start jumping on the bandwagon. They start pulling handgun ammo uh, here about two months ago. And then they started, or well, about a month ago, and then they started uh, no carry, concealed or otherwise, in their store. I went into the tire shop and I told them straight up I was carrying and uh, pardon me I could leave it out my van while they change the tires or I could sit outside in the 98 degree weather but I carry to and from Walmart I'm not just parking my I'm just not you know and you got my van inside so the gun's gonna be inside they said not a problem you know, and I went in the store. I mean, I don't have it where they, she goes, are you carrying that? I said, yes. She says, well, I can't see it. So you can slow down, mister. Yeah, there you go, jerk. Kind of big Dodge truck thinks he's something special, you know. Boy, is it, I know I said I wouldn't talk about him, but man, it's just nice to have this thing drive steering smooth again and not having that vibration in the steering wheel. I just got, it's just weird to have it. But anyways, so now because of the vaping thing, 
Walmart will no longer sell vape cigarettes. Now, here's the thing about those vape cigarettes and the deaths. Those cigarettes, the people that died from them, they all were smoking liquid pot. THC, okay? The stuff that makes you stoned. You know, it wasn't CBC oil or anything like that. It was the THC. Or it was CBC laced with the THC. And, uh, I'm sorry, but man, liquefied pot, really, guys? I mean, I, I'm, I understand that, uh, you know, you guys are, you know, there's the, the whole marijuana movement, and that's cool, but uh, if it's killing you, don't do it. I mean, if you're going to smoke pot, learn how to roll, okay? Don't, don't be lazy about it. If you're going to smoke pot, don't be lazy. Learn how to roll like we had to back in the 70s, okay? It didn't come natural to us, you know. Maybe, maybe the generation before us knew how to roll cigarettes because that's what they had mostly. But our generation, we had to learn how to roll cigarettes. You know, we had to watch the old timers see how they rolled cigarettes, so we could roll our joints. You know, learn how to put that twist on the end so it holds it in. Don't be lazy and try vaping your pot, okay? Because it's dangerous. So, anyways, guys, I'm the grumpy vlogger. <laughs> And now you know why I'm grumpy, because I don't vape pot, okay? And I don't smoke at all now. Even though that one uh, intro I did last week didn't look like it. Well, I sure hope that's not my truck that somebody stole from my driveway, because that looks just like my truck sitting in front of me. <laughs> Anyways, guys, you have a good one. Be nice to each other. And if you're vaping, don't vape pot, okay? You take care. I don't want to lose any of you out there, all right? If you're smoking pot, learn to roll. Don't be lazy, all right? Later. Bye-bye for now. Hey, folks. I know you could have watched other videos, and I want to thank you for watching mine. So, always be nice to each other, and don't forget. Okay? All right. You have a good one. I'm out of here. Bye-bye for now.